Elastic Potential Energy, Calculating the Spring Constant K by kscience.com. This is the problem you will learn how to solve. Press pause to attempt it. The method and the answer will follow. This here is an unstretched spring. A force is applied to the spring and the spring is stretched. So is energy being transferred into the elastic potential energy store of the spring. The initial length of the spring is 20 centimeters. And this 20 centimeter spring is extended to a new length of 32 centimeters. So that is the final length of the stretched spring. And the elastic potential energy stored in the spring is 1.2 joules. So we want to calculate the spring constant for this spring. So what do we have? Well, we've got the extension, which we're going to work out in a moment. And we've got the energy stored in the elastic potential energy store of the spring. We've also got 0 0.5 because that's 0 0.5, which means we're left with K, the spring constant. So we're trying to work out K, the spring constant. But how do you arrange the formula for K? If you cover K, you're left with K equals E divided by 0 0.5 times by E squared. So the spring constant equals E divided by 0 0.5 times E squared. So how do we work out E squared? We've got the final length, which is 32 centimeters. And we're going to minus the initial length of the unstretched spring, which is 20 centimeters. So we now have the extension, which is 12 centimeters. But we want E, the extension, in meters. So you divide 12 centimeters by 100 to convert the units to 0 0.12 meters. So the extension is 0 0.12 meters. But remember, the formula wants E squared. So E squared equals 0 0.12 times 0 0.12. So E squared equals 0 0.0144. So the spring constant K equals 1.2 joules divided by 0 0.5 times E squared, which is 0 0.0144. So spring constant K equals 166.7 newtons per meter. So spring constant K equals 166.7 newtons per meter. K equals 39.1 newtons per meter. So the spring constant for this spring is 39.1 newtons per meter. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes.